Hey y'all. We are on our way to Ramona, to Frosted Faces. We went last weekend. No, we didn't go last weekend. Um, yeah, we went yesterday. No. Yeah. Terry, we went Friday. Yeah, we went up to Frosted Faces on Friday. They have, oh, I love that truck. They have um, open house on Saturday and Sunday. So we decided we would go up for open house. Well, it was Friday. We got all the way up there and it was not open house. So, we found a Kentucky Fried Chicken and had some lunch. You guys are crooked. Um, so, you remember I talked to you and I put up a picture of Checker, the little black adorable poodle mix. Now they took him off their website. They do. If one of them gets adopted, they take him off. Well, I looked just a little while ago intending to go up anyway and Checker was back on. Now, I have to tell you that when I missed out on him, I said, ooh, maybe they'll bring him back. Well, I want to know why did they bring him back? Did he bite somebody or did he bark constantly? And that's the only reason that I wouldn't get him. I would just have to deal with the leg hiking thing. But um, anyway, we're on our way up to uh, see him if he's there. He might not be there. I don't know. Um, you know, they work solely on volunteers. So they can't, um, you know, they can't always get it right. Now, the little girl, Gussie, that I went up to see on Friday is not on their website today. So I think she got adopted um, on Saturday. So the lady, I think it's the lady that owns and runs Frosted Faces. I was talking to her on Friday and she said, if you want to adopt, then you need to make an appointment, which makes sense. But then when I talked to someone else, the first time I went up, they said that, you know, if you find a pup that you like, you can take it home today. So I'm not really sure. I think it has to do with, are they too busy to do uh, the final paper? But um, while, I, while we were there on Friday, there was a gal that wanted to adopt this little pit bull. And bless her heart, she was 12 years old. Her hips were really, you know, bothering her. And um, I, I just felt so bad. But the lady said they were having some flooring put in at her house and so she couldn't take her uh, right away and they told her they said well we can't we don't hold our dogs but um, pit bulls don't usually go very quickly and of course they don't because people have a thing about pit bulls. And so I, I hope that the little girl will still be there when the lady comes back to get her. Because
because the larger dogs, the pit bulls, people tend, but this little, this little gray and white pit bull was so sweet. She came over to me, she let me pet her. I mean, you could tell she was really showing her age, but, uh, not a lot of traffic today. I don't know. I I emailed them and let them know that I wanted to come up and see Checker and two other pups. There's this, and God knows we don't need another shedding pup. Mariah is enough. But Terry's laughing. Um, but anyway, they have this little pup that is a Chihuahua pug mix. He only weighs six pounds. He's the tiniest little thing. So, I think I might not mind his little hair. I'll just have to vacuum more and wash the beds more. And then there's another little guy that's a poodle mix, and he weighs about, I don't know, 18 pounds, which is fine with me. I wouldn't care if he weighed 40 pounds. His name is Schnitzel. Oh, my word. Who names these little dogs? But if they don't get uh, turned in by the owner, then... They, if they get them from the pound and they weren't turned in there by the owner, then they don't know what the poor little dog's name was. Just like Miss Hazel, when I got her, they picked her up as a stray. And they weren't calling her anything. She was in cage number blah, blah, blah. That Lancaster place, I'm telling you, that's a heartbreaker. But anyway, uh, she learned to come to Hazel just like that. I mean, you just use a few little treats. But um, I would have to see if the pup came to their name that they have. Because if they do, I don't want to confuse them. But anyway, y'all, um, I'm going to cut this off. And then I'm going to come right back because I can't see how long video is and I want to tell you about a little one that I met yesterday. Talk to you in a minute.